Pokemon games are filled with tons of things to just look for and find. The Pokemon themselves, the Zygarde cells, a reason to keep going. And another really fun thing to find is Easter eggs. In Alola, there's a children's story about a Pikachu, Slowpoke, and Pukumuku who all set off for the island challenge. You can actually find these three hanging out in Pikachu Valley, but also they just so happen to be cryogenically frozen in Lusamine's trophy room. How's that for a living dex? Diamond Dust has to be a pretty iconic one. Ever since Gen 4, the snow in certain areas gets replaced by sparkles on special dates. See, I've already got New Year's plans. That truck near the SSN is an icon of Kanto at this point. I mean, it is where you find Mew after all, but Game Freaks actually paid homage to that rumor in the Kanto remakes. There's a lava cookie there and fire red leaf green, and in Let's Go, there's a revive. They can't give you Mew for free, don't be greedy. The Pokemaniacs in Scarlet and Violet have a pretty busy design, so it's pretty easy to miss the fact that they have the Pokestar Studios logo on their shirt. Yeah, Pokestar Studios is great. It has Monica and Nightmares. And there actually have been quite a few anime Easter eggs in the games, but the most blatant has to be at the abandoned thrifty Mega Mart when you're looking for Mimikyu. One of the pictures on the wall just so happens to be of Ash and his Pikachu. Could this be a hint for an anime remake? Actually, yeah.